When I first walked in, I was scared. I expected it to be some insane, legendary spot, and it was just a dim room with a bunch of stickers. <laughs> There were all these kids there, and they had like an air hockey table. It started off, I think, as a pretty classic Keen Center. Two started as a teen art scene back in the 80s with help from then Mayor Bernie Sanders, but keeping it in concert ready shape has been a challenge. When I realized what, what we had and how special 242 is, is when other touring bands come to Burlington. There were big bands that would come through, like big punk and hardcore bands. I recall going to that place. I mean, I think Burlington is an unusual city. Since then, I've been to other city run youth centers that put on shows, and they are draconian. Every week from 7 o'clock to 8.30 at 242 Main, Burlington's new teen center. Jane Sanders, she had gone to Europe. There were these kinds of teen center art centers around, especially Germany at the time, that were sort of the thing. Definitely the closest thing in America I've seen that resembles the European youth centers. I mean, it felt like we were in charge. really helped me kind of have like a space, a sense of belonging, a place that I felt like comfortable in. I thought every, every teenager in the country had this sort of experience. I met people I never would have met. It clicked. It felt like home, right? Like the minute I walked in there, I felt like, hey, this is a spot where I belong. You know, you could go there and be pretty much accepted for being angry and depressed. <laughs> It fills a void for youth that feel there's nothing for them around the area. You need these spaces for kids to go and hang out. You know, if we care about the civic life uh, of our city, but also if we care about the development of our, of our kids, uh, it's, it's incumbent on us to, to, to create these spaces. For a couple hours, we can forget about everything out, outside and hang out and listen to some punk music and just like, I don't know, be weirdos. Mm -hmm.